Hey, this is Old Doobie from the Old Movie VR Show, and today I'm going to show you the little known procedure to factory reset your Windows Mixed Reality controller. So, the first thing you're going to need to do is have a fresh set of batteries. This is what I got here. I've got these lithium ion batteries that deliver 1.5 volts. And I've chosen to use these batteries over using regular rechargeable 1.2 volt batteries because there are some problems with using those 1.2 volt um, normal rechargeable batteries such as the controller shutting off its haptics or sometimes the controller is losing connectivity. Well, the first thing you do is get those batteries in the controller, make sure your, your controller is off. Fresh batteries in. And now, with the back off, what you want to do is press and hold the Bluetooth pairing button. And then you're going to keep that depressed. And then while that's depressed, you're going to press and hold the Windows button. So you're going to have both of those buttons together. And you hold it for five seconds. Three, four, five, and let go. And you notice there was a delay there for the lights to come on. That means the procedure was done correctly. If you let go and the lights come on immediately, that means you didn't do the procedure correctly and you need to do it again. But with that, you heard it vibrate and you saw the lights come on delayed. That means we had a successful procedure and this controller has been reset. So what you need to do now is power it off. And then start up Windows Mixed Reality Portal and re-sync your controller. And what's going to happen is it's going to re-download the software, it's going to re-sync, and you should have a functioning controller after that. So I hope that helps somebody out there. Remember to like, subscribe, and we'll see you in VR.